It's definitely my first live stream. I've never done anything like this before. So uh, this is interesting. I, I want to, uh, hold on. <laughs> so for all of you watching on YouTube or Instagram Live, uh, the links are posted uh, in Video HQ's uh, Instagram, their Facebook event page, uh, pretty much everywhere. It, it's on YouTube. Just look up Video HQ if you can't find the link. Uh, it will show you the live stream. Um, appreciate everybody who's coming in at the moment, watching on Instagram or on YouTube. Um, thank you so much. Uh, I've never done this. I, I, none of us really have. We're in a weird time right now. Uh, this is so awkward. Uh, do we play shows? Do we? Well, what do we do? Do we go to the grocery store? What do you do? Uh, it's weird. It's a weird moment in life. And um, I think a lot of things have been expressed uh, politically. Uh, I'm not going to get into politics because that is definitely not my thing. But uh, I think that a lot of things haven't been expressed uh, politically. Uh, so basically what I was going to do tonight, uh, along with uh, playing two short sets, is uh, I was going to talk a little bit about uh, how this may or may not be affecting us. And by us, I mean the noise community or the music community, the art community, the arts community, uh, for that matter. Because uh, I think uh, we are just as important as everyone else. I've always thought that way, uh, and I don't think anyone thinks otherwise. Uh, but I think it's important to have someone who is there and within it all uh, uh, talk about talk it, about and, it. Um, and uh, ask someone, someone who has, has uh, problems with anxiety, anxiety um, um, medicated, medicated for such for things, things um, and, uh, uh, and, and problems in the past with depression, with depression and other, and other points, points of interest, of interest uh, that, uh, that all, all go into, into this COVID-19 thing, thing. Uh, because, because, you know, you we're know, always worried, worried about money, of money, course, of course uh, with our jobs. A lot of us have lost our jobs. It's fucking sad. Um, but, but, you know, you other, know other than, than us, us losing, losing, losing our jobs and losing, losing what, what seems, seems like our freedoms, our freedoms uh, a big, a big, a big thing, thing uh, that, uh, that we've that lost, lost is, is our, our will, will, our willingness, willingness or our will, will to, to um, uh, keep it together, keep it together. Um, um, and not be not so depressed, so depressed uh, maybe, or, maybe or, or not be so anxious. And that's really important because... You're locked in your house, guys. You're locked in a house, someone's house somewhere. It affected my job greatly. It affected your jobs greatly. Uh, I mean, I'm staying with my parents right now. Uh, and it's affected them. They're retired. Um, I, and this all comes together with anxiety and depression. Like I said, I'm, I'm rambling. I apologize. But it, it's so important to just keep your head up and keep your head straight and do whatever it is you have to do in order to just stay sane in these weird times. I'm gonna be honest with you guys, this two week thing that you've heard, this uh, Easter thing that you've heard, that's not all set in stone. Some people think it is, it's not. We don't know how long we're gonna to have to be careful. The point is we need to be careful and we need to be careful in our hearts and within our souls and ourselves. I'm not a religious person. Um, but uh, I, I do feel that we all should look into ourselves and say to yourself, listen, hey, damn, we really need to just get it together and keep it together because it's so important. Um, uh, with that, um, I, I, a long introduction, I do apologize. Uh, I will be taking questions. Uh, I do have a question and answer uh, column kind of coming up after I play one of my sets. Um, uh, the questions I have basically for you guys, uh, what are you guys doing to stay safe? What are you guys doing to stay sane? Sanity is so important right now in all of us, uh, especially in the creative types, because we're all, we're all kind of weird and we're all kind of fucked up, so we're all dealing with it. So how are you guys staying safe? What are you guys doing? Tell me in Instagram Live, maybe in the YouTube comments, we can maybe figure something out. Tell me what you guys are doing to stay safe, to stay sane, and to stay just collected and together. Um, if you want, uh, maybe we can look through something uh, on the event page that we've posted for this evening. Um, I do apologize for this incredibly elongated uh, introduction, but I just want everyone to be okay. And it's really important that everyone is okay because 
okay is the best we can do right now, I, I feel. I mean, if you're great, that's great. If you're, if you're good, that's good. But okay is just so important. Um, because, I mean, this is gonna sound cliche and stupid uh, to some people, but I love you guys. I love all of you that are watching, that are performing, uh, and, and, and doing things like this uh, to stay sane, uh, to keep your sanity. Um, I, I, I love you all, and I wanna know how you guys are doing it, because me personally, I'm breaking down. Um, I think a lot of us are breaking down, um, and I think that's really, really hard on a lot of people, and uh, I wanna know, as I said before a thousand times already, I'm sure, I'm rambling, I wanna know how you're doing it. I wanna know what you're doing. I wanna know who you're calling. I wanna know if you're playing, I don't know, board games, if you're going outside, if you're actually not doing anything. I wanna know what you're doing. Uh, because, I, you know, even though I'm lucky enough I get to go back to work on Monday, I've still got a few more days where I've gotta deal with this. A lot of people still have a lot more time that they've gotta deal with this. Some people have lost their jobs, guys. I mean, a lot of people, and, and that's tough. That's really tough, and, and, and I feel for all of those people, and I wanna be able to help, and I think it's time for all of us to shout it out and say, this is what I'm doing, maybe it'll work for you. Um, with that, uh, I am gonna do a noise set. While I'm doing the noise set, feel free to type out whatever it is you guys are doing. Uh, maybe just say hello to some people, shout some people out, invite more people to listen to this or see this if you want them to, uh, that would be great. Uh, I mean, I, once again, what I'll do is after my set, I'll take my phone, which is located right over there, and um, I will go in there and flip around and see what you're saying, and, and uh, then we'll go from there and, and maybe do the question and answer type of thing. Uh, from that being said, uh, I haven't opened this box uh, really since February. Uh, things have been kind of weird emotionally, and um, I haven't really been in the most creative mood. I have a lot riding on me right now uh, mentally. I think a lot of us do. I don't think this COVID thing is really helping, but things are happening and uh, we're just going with it. And you know, today I opened up this box to see uh, if everything worked and you know, just sort of tested everything out. And I immediately started feeling good. Um, that being said, as far as this question and answer thing is concerned, what felt good to me is to create. And, any, and maybe creating is your out. Maybe that's the way you get the hell out of here. Maybe that's how you mentally stray away. Um, I was torturing myself not opening this box. I, I should have done it a long time ago, and I didn't. And I'm sorry about that to the people that I owe a lot of releases to. Um, I'm also uh, sorry to myself, um, which I think is very important. Um, that being said, uh, I, I've opened, like I said, I've opened this. I, I feel great opening it. Um, just looking at my stuff and, you know, making, doing the creations that you guys all know I've been doing, circuit bending and so on and so forth. And, and just, rem I, you know, I looked at all my stuff and I remembered, oh my God, this is how you do this. And I, uh, a great deal of happiness went straight through me and it felt really good. Uh, so maybe something of that nature is doing it for you. And I want you to tell people what those things are because that's so important. Uh, once again, it's we're YouTube live right now. I'm Instagram live right now. Um, the the uh, the quality might be better on YouTube. Uh, it might be better here. I don't know. We we're sort of still going through all the motions here. But the link is out there. Check out Video HQ while you're at it. Uh, these guys have been my friends for quite some time. I've been playing music with these guys for quite some time. Um, they've been doing nothing but the most they can do for our community, uh, whether it be uh, within Miami or within uh, all over the country world. I mean, I've been, I traveled to the Dominican Republic with these guys, you know, we talk to people all over the place and we try to get them down to South Florida, especially to get them to play here because everyone deserves a chance to play down here because this is a great scene and Video HQ is part of that great scene. Um, People should know that because of we're doing things like this. This forum, this room is open to musicians just like yourself. It's open to creatives just like yourself. And um, uh, you guys should know that because it, it will always be around, whether it be in this room or another you know, space over time. It doesn't matter. Video HQ is here for you. 
we're here for our arts and, and, and music and all that stuff. Um, I'm proud to be friends with these guys. Uh, Eddie and Greg are great people. And um, I thank them so much for having giving me this opportunity. Uh, so um, my name's Robbie Brantley. Some of you know me, some of you don't. Uh, my project is called Human Fluid Rot. Uh, this is going to be loud as per usual. <laughs> uh, I really appreciate you guys uh, coming in and checking out the stream. After this short set, I want to get into those questions. I want to get into those comments because I want to see what you guys are talking about in order to, um, what's the word I'm looking for here? Deal with uh, COVID-19. Uh,
Thanks a lot, guys. Thank you so much to everybody that's been uh, chiming in over and over. Um, and uh, I can't wait to read some of these questions, to be honest. Sorry if there's a little bit of a thing there. Um, anyways, if you haven't heard of Human Fluid Rock before, um, <laughs> that's it. Uh, my project's always been about uh, freedom of speech, uh, being different, being alternative, if you will. Um, just about being yourself, really. And once again, really want to thank Greg and Eddie from Video HQ uh, for letting me do this. I hope they can hear me in this mic. I'm sure they can. But um, yeah, that's uh, that's what I do. <laughs> uh, let me uh, let me get this thing uh, going here. <laughs> I'm a little out of breath. Let's see what the questions and answers you guys got here. Um, I'm interested to see what you guys have because. Um, a lot of you come from different walks of life um, and, and deal with things differently and some people deal with things just the way you do. So I'm gonna go through here and uh, check out this, uh, you know, this feed. So let's, uh, let's start from there. I'm gonna start all the way from the beginning, guys, so I appreciate you guys uh, tuning in here. Uh, the noise and drone. Okay, so someone, uh, uh, Zach Techno said, hopefully it won't affect the noise and drone scene too much. You can see that it's already affecting us. Um, we're not playing shows, guys. I mean, not all of us, obviously we all have jobs. We all have ways of doing things and ways of getting our money and paying our rent. But, um, you know, this is another way of us making money. Eight bucks is eight bucks, <laughs> as I say. Um, uh, you know, and and I, even though that's an eight dollar, uh, you know, take away from a show, uh, that's still, you know, that's that's still a fucking Big Mac, you know, that's still a fucking, you know, a, a, a bottle of water. That it, it is affecting us. It's affecting everybody, uh, but it is affecting us because uh, we are the middle class. Uh, what else we got here? Uh, this is the kind of stuff we should be doing, and all of you are. It's not awkward. It's necessary. Uh, thank you, Celeste. Uh, this is something that we should be doing. Uh, I say that because um, we might be doing this for quite some time. Um, uh, what else do we have here? Let's see what we got. <laughs> Mindy Herson said, uh, get it out, buddy. I appreciate it. Uh, th this is what I do. This is my thing. This is how I get it out. Oh, uh, God. Okay, so uh, Mindy uh, and I have been friends for quite some time. She put here um, in regard in regards to what everyone's doing to be safe and you know uh, during this time. Uh, she says she's staying home. Uh, she's alternating days at work. Now she's full time at home. Uh, she wakes up the same time daily, gets dressed, uh, you know, does the whole thing, eats healthy, hydrate, walk the neighborhood, order Uber Eats. There is ways around this, guys. Uh, we can still live our lives in ways. Uh, that everyone's semi comfortable. Yeah, uh, we are. We are not able to do some things, but uh, keeping a normal routine is huge. Um, what else we got here? Oh, uh, Mindy also FaceTime with her uh, her mom and uh, and was texting her friends. She's living her life, uh, so that's that's really important for all of you. I think uh, just live your lives as best you can. Um, Okay, uh, you're not you. Uh, said, "Hey, Robbie, thanks for uh, going uh, live tonight. Uh, working hard to stay the sane over here. A lot of meditation, books, video games, exercise, reaching out to friends and family when things get weird in my brain. This is exactly what I'm talking about. Um, you know, with with things with things like anxiety or, or, or any kind of mental health issue, um, getting out of your head is so important." And, and living your life the way that you are used to and comfortable with is so important. So doing that in any way, shape, and form is, is number one. Uh, so thanks a lot for that. Um, uh, oh, uh, Mindy also said, uh, according to this, uh, YouTube has a bunch of meditations uh, that are super helpful. If you're into meditating, I, I do it, uh, or I used to do it weekly. Um, uh, if you're into that kind of thing, definitely do that. Uh, it definitely, kind of creates a rift in the whole uh, sanity thing. It's kind of nice. Um, keep a schedule. You're not you said this. Uh, keep scheduling out the day helps a lot too. Waking up early with a purpose. Give yourself something to do. Um, I, mean, I mean, if you, listen, we, we're all got nine to five. Let's say you're working Monday to Friday. 
you know, get up at, at seven when you, when you usually do. Make yourself some breakfast, do your thing. The only thing is that's different is that you're not going to work. Maybe you do have to go to work from home. Make it work the way you need to make it work. Uh, got a lot of people uh, that tuned in on this thing and I really do appreciate it, uh, everyone that's tuned in. Um, Oh, Syrup Head Recordings, uh, big shout out to them. Really stoked about working with them uh, in the next uh, while. Uh, those guys are great, huge dudes. Uh, Fluids is an awesome band. Uh, they put those guys out, super fucking fun. Um, Syrup Head, I'm gonna get those recordings to you as soon as possible. Um, things have just been weird. Um, what else do we have here? <laughs> Zip Machine wants me to come to Australia. I had plans uh, this year. I was going to try to do it. Then the fires came along, and I couldn't. Uh, I do have a lot of friends uh, out there, um, and, I, and I do want to get out there and, uh, and and check out Australia. I got uh, man, it'd be great to see Ness and great to see Pete and all those guys and all those grinders out there. Um, it's uh, Australia is a big up for me, and I and I really would like to go there in the, in the near future. Um. Fred's Free Stuff said, uh, dude, I just love this. This is so much fun. Appreciate that. Uh, man, a lot, of, a lot of my homies were on this. Um, <laughs> Chelsea Bridge. Uh, Mel, <laughs> Mel I, I, uh, I watched m uh, most of your stream. I was, I, I was getting ready to do this, obviously. But, man, if you don't check out Chelsea Bridge, you guys, please check out Chelsea Bridge. She's in Chicago. She's, she's a ripper. Um, so uh, as far as questions are concerned, uh, it doesn't seem like there's too much here. I know I did start it uh, a little early. I hope the speech is still connecting to the Bluetooth speaker in my mom's room. That's fucked up, Haley. Uh, <laughs> uh, what else do we have here? Uh, Street Brad said, I love you so much. You're such an important person in my life, like Eddie and Greg. Not sure if I am dealing with it and just trying to day by day to do what I have to do, trying different routines and not overthinking. Listen, guys, routines and things like this aren't going to come naturally. Uh, we've never, no one's ever dealt with this before, especially in our era. Uh, we've never dealt with this. Um, if you find a routine, great. Uh, if you don't, try something different. It doesn't have to be painstaking and it doesn't have to be. Um, you know, a, a big, it doesn't have to be stressful. Make it, make life less stressful for yourself, not just during this weird pandemic, but in life in general. So it's good to hear uh, from Gladys. She's, she's a huge friend. I, I love her to death. Um, she also mentioned that having friends uh, is, is great. Um, obviously guys, keep in touch with each other. Do your thing uh, because uh, you guys, we gotta connect because we're not connecting person to person anymore. We're connecting via the internet, especially right now. Uh, it's big, it's important. Uh, what else do we have here? <laughs> they really want me to start the talk show. Uh, okay, so uh, Sweat Long, my friend Pete from Australia. If you want sick meditation drones, find the Pulse Emitter Meditation Music Releases and David Miles Huber. I never actually checked those out myself. Uh, if it's coming from Pete, I definitely say go with it because uh, he is uh, versed in really great sounds. So uh, Pete, thank you so much for that. Uh, once again, that's uh, Pulse Emitter Meditation and uh, releases from David Miles Huber. Um, those are all really great options. Thank you so much, Pete. Um, um, okay, um, Atopka says, uh, making noise has b most definitely been my safe haven and the way to get out of my own head. Thank you for the sentiment. Much love. Like I said, guys, find your creative outlet, please. Find it and just and grab it by the balls and yank it. It's so important, guys. Um, uh, okay, another thing that Mindy said, she was apparently streaming this whole entire time. Uh, don't put deadlines on yourself. Be flexible and breathe. That's really important, guys. Um, once again, you may not be able to find your relaxing aura or your relaxing moment, uh, but you will. Don't stress it. Don't rush it. Just be there, and we're all here for you. Your friends are here for you. Your family is here for you. This is a weird time in our lives. Let's just grip it and rip it because it's so important. Um, Gunther, uh, a really good friend of mine from uh, Radioactive Records who's still doing uh, pickup services, so get the, and get into that. Uh, Gunther set up his drum kit and he's trying to stay away from the tech and time of being. It's working so far. 
Gunther is a great musician. He's been a, a musician for a long time. He's been in some great bands, and um, that's what he's doing. That's his in. He's setting up the drum set. He's getting it in, and he's just playing, and he's trying to get out of his own head. Thanks a lot for that, Gunther. Um, listen, guys, uh, I, I am going to do one more set. It will be short. I know these guys probably want to go home. Um, but uh, but I, this live stream has been a huge success. Um, I really do appreciate everyone chiming in and um, and being a part of it. Uh, once again, <clears throat> oh, <laughs> uh, once again, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> uh, once again, uh, the 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 meaning. If you're just joining us uh, or joining everyone, um, uh, the main reason I had this uh, YouTube live and and this. Uh, this stream going on on Instagram was because I wanted to get in touch with people to see what you guys are doing to cope with the COVID-19 virus thingy. A lot of us are having a really hard time coping with it. A lot of us have lost our jobs. A lot of us have lost family, friends over this, and it's incredibly uh, a moving moment in our lives. It's incredibly depressing in some points, and it makes a lot of us anxious. So if you're tuning in now, uh, I'm going to do one more set, but in that time that I'm doing that one set, um, I'd like you guys just to keep going as far as listing things in order what you're doing to stay sane in these crazy times. Um, because people are reading this, people are chiming in all over the place, and they need to know uh, we're all family here, uh, the, uh, especially whether it be arts or music. Or, or just day-to-day -day living, we're all family. And I want everyone to know the options that they have in order to cope with this coronavirus thing, because it's tough for a lot of people, and um, every little bit helps. So I'm gonna put this uh, this phone back, because uh, things get a little messy over here, as most of you know. <laughs> um, once again, I wanna thank Vidium. Uh, and as I said uh, earlier in the podcast, if you're just now uh, toning in or tuning in, sorry, yeah. Um, uh, check out Vidium HQ and their video uh, projects and their music projects. I've been working with these guys, like I said, a really long time, and they're really good friends of mine, and I love them very much. And they've been helping me out, and uh, we've been helping each other out. Really, that's what this is all about—helping each other during uh, COVID nineteen, and uh, so on and so forth. So I really appreciate them. Uh, this uh, first sample that I'm going to play is an oldie, uh, but a favorite. Um, my name is Robbie Brantley. Um, keep those comments coming. Let these people know what's going on. Everyone is helping, and it's so great to see everyone on the on the podcast, or, you know, on the live stream. Um, thank you so much to everybody, and um, I hope you guys have a great night, and uh, you guys survive uh, through this crazy fucking time. Because it's just that. It is just a crazy time. So I'm going to do one more set, just a couple more minutes. Thank you guys so much.
Once again, guys, thank you so much. Uh, while we're still here for just a few more minutes, I want to bring out Greg and Eddie and thank them so much. I want you guys to see who is behind all of this. It's incredibly important to me that they are shown and because they've done so much for so many people and, and don't even, I mean, they don't even ask for the credit. Just if you guys could come out here really, really quick and just say hello to all these people, all these freaks. <laughs> uh, I really appreciate it. Thanks so much, Eddie. Thank you, Greg. Listen, guys, COVID-19, make it fucking the best you fucking can, please. These guys are great. You guys are great. Thank you so much. Thank you for tuning in. Uh, thank you for tuning into YouTube, Instagram, everything that we have available. Um, I probably will have this recording um, for something uh, as a release. I, I plan on having it as a release at least. Uh, we're going we're gonna to check and see if the options for that. Uh, but uh, thank you all so very much for all of this. Um, Stick around for more stuff that's coming from Vidium and more stuff that's actually coming from uh, Heavy Days as well, who's on Twitch. If you guys are on Twitch and uh, are into the noise stuff uh, like I am, uh, Twitch is a great outlet for that as well. They're doing live streams. Thank you guys so much for everything. Be safe. Be sane. There's so much love out there for all of you. Thank you. Welcome to New Music Theater. Hey, every geekle has an unconscious idea of what good art is. The New Way Theater Drill Bit Survey says real art always has some stack of the unknown woven into its spine. Guess there's nothing like the unknown to make people stop.